Hey guys, it is officially spring. It's the first week of May and it's time to pull out the white denim. Today I'm gonna to be showing you seven ways on how to wear white denim shorts. Welcome back to my channel. I'm super excited about this video. I love styling videos. And today I'm gonna to show you guys seven ways on how to wear these adorable white shorts from Target. If you don't know me, my name is Brittany Cruz, here to help you shine bright with style, grace, and confidence. If you haven't already, make sure to like this video, subscribe, and hit the notifications bell so you can get notified when I do videos. Okay guys, so I love styling videos. I picked up these jean shorts from Target for $15. They are amazing, look at them. Boom, boom. Okay, so let me show them off to you and tell you why these specific, these specific jeans are great for any body type. Number one, it's great because they're high waisted. Really helpful for the pooch. If you have a little pooch, which I have a little pooch, then and you wanna hide that little pooch, then what you're gonna wanna do is get high waisted jeans or high waisted shorts. And here they are. You're gonna wanna look for something between nine and 11 inches so it can really, really get up to your waist. For me, I have the longest torso ever. It adds, it's like half of my height. Literally, if you fold me in half, I am half my legs because my torso is so tall. So I need really, really high waisted things. And so these are really high. It is, how many buttons? One, two, three, four four buttons up. I am usually like to be in the space of four to six buttons because my waist is so high, but these are great. They're button up, which is great. It's not a zip up. Zip ups tend to create, um, zip up jeans tend to create little wrinkles going up your crotch area. And so buttons do a really good job of hiding the pooch. Also the back, the Pockets are in the higher space of the jeans if you guys can't tell here. They're higher up to the top Also, what really helps is that it has a Triangle on the back that's gonna help with people with a little bit of booty But if you don't have much of a booty, it's gonna help you look like you have a booty And then finally the back of the jeans are longer than the front as you can see it's longer in the back than it is in the front. So if you guys end up making your own shorts, remember what's gonna be the most flattering is the back is gonna be uh, longer than the front. And then finally, because the back is longer than the front, as you can see, it has a little bit of a curve on the side of the jean. This is helpful to create an illusion that your legs are skinnier than they are. And so it's going to help anybody and any body type, especially the thick leg girls, which is who's part of the thick leg club. So the first shirt that I paired it with, and I didn't, I didn't wear any shoes, and the reason why is because I'm quarantined and I haven't worn real shoes in like six weeks. I haven't worn heels, I haven't worn anything. But I will bring back shoes later on when it's time. But right now, I'm not ready to wear shoes. So I'm just showing you outfits without shoes, okay? So be okay with that. So the first item that I paired these jeans with is with a white t-shirt. White on white looks so fresh, so clean, and I paired it with my favorite Forever 21 um, scripture tee. It says believe on the collar, and also Thessalonians. 2 and 13 on the side. I love this shirt so much. I picked it up from Forever 21. I will link it down below. White on white is a great pick. It just adds freshness to your outfit. It's um, wearing white jeans definitely is a risk sometimes, but if you pick the right material and the right fit, it's gonna work well for you. So these are great. This is a great outfit to wear to a barbecue, out running errands, no matter what, you're gonna look adorable with a white on white outfit. So that is the first look. The second outfit that I chose is not quite white on white, but I stayed in the same family with a cream peasant top. I love the peasant top look still, and also I'm I'm taking on so many trends in one shirt. I mean, because it's one color, it doesn't look like so much. Keep that in mind, guys. It definitely adds a little bit of upscale to the outfit. So it's a cream peasant top with ruching up up the neck. It also has wide sleeves or bubble sleeves. 
which is a really big trend right now and also on top of that it's cropped all in one I decided to pick something larger and the reason why is because um, I wanted I got an extra large like I could have gotten a medium or a large and it would have been like a bra type thing but I wanted to still be able to wear these and tuck it into a shirt if tuck it into high-waisted jeans if I ever wanted to um, or wear it as a crop top the way I have it in this video here this is a great top and pairing the same families of creams and whites together just look so fresh and so nice definitely take that tip with you to your closet and see what you have also what makes this work is it's not a cream t-shirt well cream t-shirt would still work too but it's different material one is jean and the other is more of a linen material so it creates this rich factor and adds a little bit of class to your high-waisted and cut-off jeans the next item that I picked to wear is another upscale item and you can never go wrong with this in your closet is a striped button up. This is from Zara that I picked up from Zara, oh my gosh, 2013. Yes, I've had this shirt since before my son was born. This can last forever in your closet but pairing it with the white jeans just has that amazing and cute sailor look can you just see me in like espadrilles or heels at a party holding champagne giving a toast to the captain yes this is adorable I can add a hat to this I can do so much but let me just show you the basic look of just wearing this shirt now I styled it a little bit differently last year I tied it up into a little knot together this year I think I'm gonna do that start the half tuck where you just tuck you unbutton it a little bit and you tuck half of the shirt in and let the other half hang out and it just looks so cute guys definitely add some extra oomph to your white jeans the next item is another long sleeve item but it's a light sweater like item this shirt I picked up from Target it's by a new day I love this shirt so much I picked it up in the um, I think it was the clearance section it was such a nice item to add to my closet let me tell you the material also so you guys know this is gonna last it washes well it hasn't knitted or knotted up at all as far as like the sweater material but it's made out of rayon and spandex which means it's gonna feel nice on a woman's body i picked it up in a large and the reason why i got it large was because the sleeves i wanted it longer than my hands and also i wanted to tie it and it still droop over any pants that i'm wearing and so this is a great great shirt to have in your closet it's basically a button-up cardigan but it's just in that light color and so wearing it with white jeans just gives you that fresh look again and it's just a great shirt to have in your closet the next item that i have is this black t-shirt that i'm wearing in this video i love this shirt it is from h&m the divided um dividend oh, it's dividend or divided i'll fix it in the link below but i picked up this shirt and you can get it in all colors it's a crop shirt i got it in large and also it's a really thick cotton material so it's gonna wash and iron really really well you wouldn't think that just this t-shirt and these white jeans would look nice but the color blocking of the pure black and the pure white just makes the outfit so chic i can see myself wearing sneakers and a little backpack it's kind of sporty it's really helpful to try out these color block items um, or color blocks in your closet you would never think that it would be a cute outfit until you just put it on and you have the right jewelry and the right items and boom you got yourself an adorable outfit all right and to my favorite shirt in my closet right now which is my Hakuna Matata shirt that I picked up from Target this was kind of an expensive buy for me I usually wouldn't buy a t-shirt for $25 and it was on sale for $25 However, I did look at Urban Outfitters and all of their shirts were $39 to $50. So I thought this would still be a really great buy. I love this shirt. It's, a, it's probably 100% cotton. Let me look. Okay, this is 100% cotton. However, it is not a thin shirt. This shirt is thick, which means it's going to last me a lifetime of wear and tear and cutting and playing and different things like that. I love this shirt so much. I love the colors. It reminds me of sunset, so it's perfect to transition into the summertime, spring into summer. And then pairing it with the white jeans just ha adds to that color palette that I have here. I love it so much. It is such a really great shirt. You can be worn 
and as a dress, but with these jeans, it just adds that extra freshness to it. I love these white jeans, they're so cute. And then finally, a really cute resort outfit is this tank top that I picked up. Oh, I can read this, divided. It's divided. Picked up from H&M years, literally years ago. It has lasted me so long in my closet. I bring it on every vacation because it just goes with everything. Um, you can wear it off the shoulder, you can tuck it in, you can tie it. This is a, just, I can't explain it. It's just a lace shirt, super easy. Um, I picked it up in a really large size, in a 14, and the reason why I wanted to tuck it in, I want it to be able to droop and fall and be loose on me. Um, all I wear with it is just a um, strapless bra, any color, brown or black, and either way it looks good, and paired it with the white jeans, oh my gosh, really just stepped up this shirt, definitely. So pairing this together definitely adds that extra resort feel. It's straight out of vacation. I'm in Cabo. I have my hat on. I got my sandals on. It is so cute. I love this outfit so much. So yeah, this is a really great outfit to wear and a great item in your closet is something lace. And that is it. Thank you guys for joining me today as I explain to you some really amazing outfits that go with white jeans. Share with me down below your favorite outfit and then also don't forget to like, subscribe, and also hit the notifications bell so you can get notified of when I do more videos. Again, see you guys next week and you guys have an amazing day and don't forget, shine bright. Bye y'all.